What's up? What's happening? What's good? What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Nine Boulevard. My name is Cohen Williams. I'm not here alone. I'm here with my Valentine. Who am I? You didn't ask me to be a Valentine, Conch. Didn't I? Mm-mm. Okay, let me ask you now. Okay, please do. Bali. Primrose. Ayanda Kukse. No masa. Bamba. Will you make me the realest nigga in the world? All right, all right. And be my Valentine. Yeah. 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 What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the Apple of My name is Cole Williams. Good morning, I'm not here alone. I'm here with the, with my Valentine. Oh. <laughs> yes, that's true. Balimbamba. Hi, guys. What's up? Hey, happy love day. Oh, my goodness. Happy Valentine's Day. I don't like the word Valentine. I don't know. I've always said, like, happy love day. I think for the past, like, four years. Yeah, Every time why? I say, I don't know what it is. I just feel like it's a love. It's the, it's the day of love. Valentine makes it feel like you have to have a Valentine. You have to have somebody. When it's a love day, you can love anybody. Okay, so So I'm starting it now. Happy love day. Doesn't she look like Solange, guys? I, is it the wig? Does the wig really? Because it's the second time. It's just the hair, babe. It must be. It literally just, that's all. So, today. We are having a little bit of fun with you guys. It's Valentine's Day. It's love day. We're just going to have fun. We're going to take a couple of random quizzes we found on the internet because, you know, it's better to know if we're meant to be forever. And, you know, no things yeah. like when we're going to get married, how many kids we're going to have, yeah. if we're and single. You, you guys know, like, there's no other way to actually know if I mean, how? someone is yours until you do an internet survey. Quiz. Quiz. Wow. I really hope we get good answers otherwise. <laughs> I mean, then we'll know know the truth. The truth? We'll know the truth. So you telling me that if one of these things says y'all need to break up now. I mean, we might need to consider... Breaking up. Thinking about it because... The internet. The the internet said said so. so. Yeah. So we have to do it if the internet... We have to follow what the quiz says. Wow. So this first one is from quiz.lovetoknow.com. And it's just called Take a Relationship Quiz Together. While taking a walk, you both Okay, say see... question one. Question one. <laughs> say, it, say it again. Okay. Question one. Say it looking at the camera. Question one. It's like proper. Question one. <laughs> While taking a walk, you both see a $50 bill fall out of an elderly lady's purse. You pick up the money and decide together to do what with it. I think we need to know the value of $50 before we can... Okay. We cool. can say what we're going to do with it. Let's see. Dollar. In rands. 742 rand 10 cents. 700 rand, okay. Okay, now, now. 750 this, rand. This, this, changes, this changes the game a bit. One of you wants to keep it, the other wants to give it back. We fight about what to do and give it back at the end. We give it back to the woman, it's the right thing to do. And we keep the money to pay for your date tonight. So while we were walking, we both see a $50 bill fall from mm. an elderly lady's purse. Mm. We see her there. Yes. I'll I'll, give it I'm back. saying you're giving it back. Oh, <laughs> you're such a good man. I agree, dude. <laughs> Who would steal from an elderly lady? Especially like 700, like once you put value behind yeah. it, that makes it like You don't crazy. know what she was going to do with Bruh. it, you know? So okay, give, give, it it, give it back. Question number two. You are friends with another couple. You both know that one of the people, ooh, and the couple had an affair. Did you tell the spouse that the partner had an affair? Together we talk to the spouse having an affair and encourage him or her to come forward about it. Neither of us tell them because it's none of our business. One of you insists on telling, despite the other pleading to keep it a secret. We agree the one closest to the faithful spouse will tell them. Okay, I'm normally I'm none of your business type of girl, mm-hmm. right? But like that's if I saw it by myself or you saw it by yourself. Like there's no witnesses. Yeah. I think if we can both sit the person down and be like, honey, look, we just need to tell you something. How you react is none of our business. So you tell the person that's getting cheated on. Yes. 
but again, you have to let the person know that whatever they decide to do, there's no judgment there. You just wanted to tell the truth. This is what you saw. You don't know what to make of it, but this is how you saw it. If it was a clear thing, like you were obviously cheating, then, you know, we sp- just sp- spit the facts and then let the person decide what they do. And without judgment, if they stay together. But that's not what this thing is saying. You have the options. It's either we talk to, oh yeah, together we talk to the one having the affair. Mm. Okay, we can do that. Not encourage. I don't like the word encourage. I say insist. Like, you need to tell the person. You have extra money in the budget this month and each of you wants to buy something with it. You don't have enough money to buy both things. What do you do? Option one, you fight over it for days and neither gets what he or she wants. Two, decide to save up more money and buy both things when you can afford them. We figure out who bought something last and give the other person a chance to hear what he or she wants. That sounds like such a baby thing. Like, yeah. like, like you know, when you have two kids. Yeah. yeah. One of you makes a purchase before the other has a chance. I think we'd save up. I think we'd save up. We yeah. definitely would save up. Everything else just sounds so dumb. <laughs> yeah. That's like so childish. Yeah. Like, we're never going to have more money so we won't ever... You just save up. Just save up. Together. And then like you buy it, you do a whole yeah. purchase together. And also it depends on together. what it is. You know, if it's something that you need. Obviously the one who needs it would get it more. Like, yeah. get it first. So we save up the money and buy both things. Question four. <laughs> a big holiday is coming up. You both want to spend the day with your family. You only have time to see one family that day. How do you decide what to do? You split up and visit each of your family separately. You each make plans with your own family and hope the other person gives in. You visit one family last year, so now you're spending the family with the other side. Evaluate which family sees you more often and choose to visit the other one on the actual holiday. If we stay away from our families throughout the year, yeah. I would say we do uh, alternating each year. Yes, but... Oh, okay, yeah. So if we, if, stay, if we don't live with... Like, we live far away from each other. Both of them, them yeah, yes. Then we'd go one year... One year, one year. Yeah. yeah. So which one is that? You visit one family last year, so you're spending the holiday with the other side. Yeah. Okay. That's what we're doing. All right. One of you gets a huge promotion to your dream job, but it requires relocating hundreds of miles away and the other person giving up their job. What do we do? We move! I anyway. didn't hear the question, Baba. Why aren't you listening? You're not like, you're reading like, like, like. Like not, I'm reading. Like read for understanding. We, we, we go where the money is. <laughs> I mean, duh! Like, really? I don't. <laughs> we follow the promotions. I mean, I mean, if I, if the other person could go and get a job, the other side, I mean, we go. And if yeah. the promotion is big enough that, like, if it makes sense, nice. you know, if it makes sense, if we are going to but be also making if it's more, your if dream have, if job, are, if it's the other person's dream job, no, I don't think either of us would be like, no, no, take it because. Okay, but now also that person needs to be logical. Are we gonna struggle there while they're doing their dream job? No, no, no. It, it has a lot of money too. It's a dream job that has a lot of money. That's why I'm saying, like, even removing the dream job part. Yeah. Does it make sense financially for us to True. move? Child. Question six. One of you maintains a friendship with an ex and makes plans to get together with them. How does your partner respond? Really? Excuse me, what? If your friends one of ex, you maintains a relationship with your ex, and now you want to meet up with your ex to hang out. Depends on the relationship. I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is the dumbest shit I've ever seen. I'm sorry. This is the dumbest. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let's read the let's read the options. Tell you to have a good time. Friendships are an important part of life. Ask you not to go because they feel insecure about it, but you go anyway. We would react differently in the situation. Demand you never spe- see or speak to your ex again. This relationship will be, or this relationship will end. Discuss any feelings, positive or negative, about the situation. Then trust you to maintain an appropriate relationship with the ex. The last option. What do you mean? Like you're not friends with your exes? What? Hmm. What was that to say? Discuss any feelings, positive or negative, about the situation. Then trust you to maintain an appropriate relationship with an ex. Yeah. Do you want me to tell you yeah, to stop being do friends with your friends? No, we do that. Okay. 
We do that. So I then what, what, <laughs> it just feels weird because I'm not actually friends with any of my exes. And then you... <laughs> Here you are just like, 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 friends galore. And I'm supposed to be like, what? so what? Do we have different wait, reactions? Wait, wait, wait. <laughs> wait, I, was, I didn't hear the question. Okay, what did you think the question was? Huh? What did you think the question was? I don't know. I wasn't, I wasn't like thinking far. Okay. I just, I just thought here. What do you mean here? My okay. thought process ended here. But yeah, definitely discuss the uh, feelings, positive or negative. <laughs> <laughs> mm-hmm. About this. It depends on the relationship, honestly. Um, you're going to tell me if you feel insecure about so and so because so and so is doing so and so, such yeah. and such and such, just this and that and that and that. Then I'll be like, okay, cool, I respect that and um, we'll fix it. Okay. Yeah. All right. If you're cool with it and and you know the person and yeah it's, it's whatever you know. So now if 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 I have a friendship with one of my exes, mm. you will just have to discuss it. We'll just I need to figure out what the relationship is. I'm sorry. I just need to make sure that our relationship is not full of double standards. No, no, it's not. Okay, cool. discuss it. Discuss it. Ex, you're Question seven. <laughs> Which best describes the way you feel after discussing a difficult issue with your partner? How do you feel right now? It's not a difficult uh-huh. issue. Uh-huh. Okay. Your partner never listens to you and no issues ever get resolved by talking. Your concerns were heard, respected, and a possible solution was agreed on. Your partner heard your concerns and agreed to think about how they could help you deal with the issue. Your partner tried to listen, but just couldn't understand where you were coming from. We've resolved every issue that we've yeah, had. Yeah. And we resolved it fairly quickly, I think. Yeah. Fairly quickly. Fairly quickly. Compared to other people. Other true, people. True. So we talk about it. Mm-hmm. And it's always a misunderstanding. Yeah. Most of the time. Of the it's time. always a misunderstanding. It's always what you thought. Yeah. And what you thought. <laughs> Which is which might not be reality. Oh, you mean oh, what you thought that might not be. What you thought might not be real. And what you thought might not be real either. So that's how we fight. Yeah, yeah. Because mm. mostly what, what what you thought and or like, what you think too. Just confu- we get we yeah, get confused. Yeah, we thinking. just so sometimes you just think something is is, but it's not. Just like you, know? you think something is. And then I just like sometimes I have to like explain to you. Okay, now this is how it actually is because you're thinking it's not. You or know? sometimes I just have to like yeah. let you figure so, out yeah, what so it actually basically, is. Basically. You and then we discuss it, and then you realize that it wasn't what you thought it was. Sometimes, sometimes you think it's not. It's what it it, but it's not. The same way you think it is, but it really never is. Mm, mm. I would say, but I would say most of the time you are usually wrong. Well, not wrong is a bad word, but like sometimes you're not right. And I'm right. So you mean like the fact that most of well, the time? Well, I'm not right. I'm sometimes you are not right, and I'm not wrong. Or you mean the fact that most of the time I'm right and you're actually wrong? That is <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, okay. Okay. Um, we talk, we respect, <laughs> and we come up with the solution. Yes. Uh, we'll talk about how we fight one day, guys. It's actually very interesting. It's a fun time. We don't fight. That's the thing. That's what I'm saying. Like, we have to talk about how we come up with, how we have disagreements and how we, because it's, it's very, I've never experienced this in my life. Really? Have, have you? Aww. Have you? <laughs> have you actually, like, love like, is in the oh air. Oh my gosh. Next question. Yeah. <laughs> but have you, though? Have I experienced the fight like this? Have you ever <sighs> think of me? Help me. Anymore? Help me. Do you? <laughs> <laughs> what are you? What are you? What are you asking me? I was asking, have you ever like experienced fighting like this? Like, or, not fighting, arguments, disagreements, the way we disagree. It. Um. No. That's what I'm saying. It's very interesting. And I think people will be interested in it. 
Yeah. Because it's like a very different method of arguing for me. I know pop- people have probably figured it out before, but like I've just been having yeah. my mind blown. But I mean, also you're Latin. You got Latin blood. <laughs> Y'all don't know how many times. She's feisty. I'm not feisty. You, 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 you get, you get. <laughs> but it's kind of hard, so that, I think that's why we never like really get far. We never get far because I'm like, he, always, he literally always goes, Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> look, I'm mad. <laughs> She's like a little, like little firecracker. It's just, it's, it's cute. Uh, it's not you. threatening. It's just, it's just. Oh, oh I, I don't scare you. It's hard. You know, it's like it's like you're in an action movie. <laughs> okay, this video is not about lead how role. we fight. Ding, <laughs> ding, ding, ding. Okay, we'll talk about how we fight. One day. Comment down in the comment section below if you want to need if you need and then together. All right, do that. <laughs> comment okay. comment in the comment section down below if you would leave. if you want to hear how we argue. How we argue or settle disagreements. How we get through. Did your hair is getting so long? It is. Question eight. Question eight. Your partner's best friend hits on you. <gasps> Do you tell your partner or spare their feelings and keep it a secret? I, I ain't even gonna read the options. Boy, what you would you what mm, first of all, which one of you is gonna be the betrayer? Best friend though. Okay, it's just okay. Let's say instead of best friend, let's say squad. One other person from like okay. your, but like your close squad, yeah, like your boys. Because I don't think I don't think any best friend. Would. No, no best. What would you do? Would you Would you tell me? Yeah, of course I'd tell you. You better so that I can go crazy. <laughs> but I wouldn't be like, yo, take care of her. I'd just be like, yo, bro, like. Be yeah. aware of the situation. Just. What's going on? I'll be like, what? Is she always like this? <laughs> Let me tell you how I would tell you. I'll be like, boy, so I was just sitting, minding my own business, and then your brother, your friend, decided to walk up to me and tell me something that I didn't want to hear. No. Yes, he did. He did what? Yes, he did. Who? I mean, how, how Who? dare he disrespect Where our he relationship? Where he at? Our relationship? Where is he? Who the but like, we have to tell him. That is because for me it's just like one the person doesn't respect you as their friend yeah. and two this person doesn't respect dude i don't understand people that cheat in the same friend group what are you doing <laughs> who do you think you are <laughs> i think it's a very it's a, it's a very it's a childish, it's a childish thing. thing it's a selfish thing it's a thing that you do in high school i don't think as a grown-up you, you do stuff like that that's weird in high school I, when i'm talking as adults Boys are boys. And girls are girls All right. too. And then outside of high school, some boys grow up, some boys don't. Some boys stay boys. And then when you go into the work environment, some boys grow up, some boys don't. They stay boys. So there will always be those boys who are boys in all sectors of life. But there are those who eventually grow up. Holland. So grow up. I've been I've been a boy. You've been a boy. I've been a boy. I'm glad you're not a boy. I'm no a man more. now. I don't have time for. I'm boys. a man. We <laughs> <laughs> don't have time for boys no more. Men don't, don't cheat. Man. That's why they say men don't cheat. Boys cheat. Men don't cheat. Boys are trash. Mm, men are trash too. Because they boys. That that behavior is boyish behavior. Not being able to communicate with your feelings to a woman, yeah. but instead you just want to beat her up or rape her. You you mind is yes. immature. You're a boy. Okay, so we we yeah. both tell our partner. Okay, cool. But yeah, no, come on. Men are still trashed. Okay, our quiz results. We are a dream team. Yeah. We win Valentine's Day. It says you and your partner have great communication skills and are able to get through the most difficult situation because of it. Mm. You either have the exact same set of morals and values or respect each other enough to come to consensus Woo! on important issues. You are the kind of couple who can set the example for others. I goals. <laughs> I get. And serve as an inspiration they for heard what it. I they heard They didn't hear it from us. <laughs> the internet has spoken. They heard it. We are ghosts. 
the dream team. So now that you guys know that we're the ultimate couple. <laughs> and that we are couple goals. Not according to us. The internet. Internet said so. We did a test. <gasps> we passed the test. We passed the test. We are couple goals. And we are likely to... Inspire. Others. Mm. To show them what a relationship should look like. This channel... Mm. Is an inspiration. Inspiration. To, uh, according to the internet. Us. Not, we're not saying this. Mm-mm. Don't, don't, no, please, oh, please don't. don't, don't, don't. We don't like that. We don't believe that. We're humble. No, we're, we're so humble. So humble. So humble. But the internet says. The internet says that we are. You know. Couple goals. Goals. Who are we? To. Are you? With the internet. Come on. Please. Okay, I'm gonna fart so they stop talking about it for five seconds. Thank you guys for watching. Bali just farted, so I need to go. Uh, we appreciate all the love and all the support, all the comments Ooh. in the comment section. Please uh, don't forget to subscribe, comment, and share and like. Thank you. Bye. Damn. That was a bad one. Wait, so are we done with the video? Okay, but like, we have to end up properly. That's not the end because we were in the middle of a sentence when I said I need to fart. Is that so? We're gonna do the first two videos, the first three quizzes. Are we fine? Because also an hour, I think that's fine. Okay, cool. Bye. I think I need to fart again.